like that a lot. Mmm. Mmm, 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 Well, welcome to Popcorn and Props. It's Sunday night. It's 8 p.m. And, well, okay, it's a little after 8 p.m., so that means I'm right on time. As usual, running late. It's been a good day. I have, uh, man, it's been a hell of a week. I am teaching a 107 course. I mentioned it in my Michael Rollins interview that I'm going to be instructing for, uh, a first responders part 107 course and uh i've been building powerpoint slides all freaking week and i'm sick of looking at google slides uh holy cow but i got to go out and rip today and i actually have a flight clip it's not like a heavily edited sort of thing it's just me and steel were doing what we do which is just goof around and perch on buildings and do dumb stuff and look at it and uh it's kind of when perching goes wrong, <laughs> but it's a funny clip. I'm going to show that here in a few minutes. If you guys have never been here for a popcorn and props before, the whole premise is pretty simple. We hang out. You guys get to submit your videos. We're going to watch them live on stream and just shoot the shit and talk about FPV. If you got any questions about gear, if you got any questions about like pop culture or anything hit me up in the chat i'm also on discord if you want to join over there it's supposed to be patrons only but until discord and patron get their crap together uh it's kind of unlocked for now so you know it be that what it is uh if somebody abuses it then we will just have to shut it down and take away all the fun times mm. speaking of tasty though i got so i stopped and got some beer and i got something new golden road brewery I don't where where are these guys? Oh, it's a California thing. Golden Road Brewery Pineapple Cart. It's a wheat beer with pineapple and blood orange. That thing is tasty. Oh shit, we got we got Tidwell up in the chat too. What's up Tidwell? Tidwell was there today. Hey. And uh, that Tango 2 is treating me really, really nice. I got some questions from Skadoosh about it today. Apparently he saw one uh in person and uh i'm not gonna give away any secrets here uh if you're watching trappy i won't give away any secrets but skadoosh saw it in action well he saw it in person at the tank i can't talk tonight skadoosh saw it in person at tbs's offices and was asking me all about it how this feature works how that feature works what do you think about this are you struggling with that and one of the things in particular that he asked me about was the uh he asked uh is because the, the switches they're not like your typical radio switches um they're just different i can't really say how yet uh, you'll have to wait and see for yourself. But he was like, are they difficult to operate? Like, I feel like if you get in a situation where you're freaking out and you got to disarm or whatever, that people might have trouble with it. And I got to say, like, it, there's a there's a uh, like break in period where you get used to a new radio. I've done it when I went from the X9D to the QX7 to the Nirvana. I used a Spectrum iX12 for a week. It took me some time to get used to that. Like I've I've gone radio to radio many a times, and yeah, it took me a little bit of time to get used to where the switches and stuff were. But I will say at this point, I'm like a freaking master, and this serious. clip is going to show it off. In, in spades so this is what happens when per building perching goes wrong i gotta i gotta edit it some more because you can't really tell how high up we are but just know that this is at the top of like a skyscraper in atlanta uh doing a little bit of perching and uh it, it, it goes wrong and i gotta use turtle mode to get off of a building <laughs> oh god okay uh let's just go over here how do we do this i need to move my keyboard closer to me and so there's like this teeny tiny little window ledge I was trying to get on. See it there? I was like, I can make it work. I can make this work. No bueno, no bueno, no bueno. <laughs> so now you got a turtle mode. But you, you run the risk of... <laughs> I was rearmed so quick that I didn't even believe I'd done it successfully. I was like, everything's stable? Everything's good? I don't have to, I don't have to flip switches again? I'm, I'm good? I can just fly away? Holy crap. Watch this. Look at how quick this happens.
and we're falling, and we're disarmed, rearmed, and flying away. <laughs> oh man. When turtle mode goes wrong. That was right. crazy. Or no, when perching goes wrong, but turtle mode goes so so right. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of those yeah, you saved your ass. You know you've arrived to save yourself from that type of thing. Dude, I can't like I, that's cut. I sat on the ledge upside down for a minute because I just sat there in my brain and I was like, okay, you're going to turtle mode arm. When I flip it over, I got to disarm, flip this switch, rearm, disarm, flip this switch, rearm, disarm, flip this switch, rearm. Like I was working it through in my brain over and over and over. And then I was like, all right, here we go. Flip over. And then sure enough, it fell. And I was like, disarm, flip this switch, rearm. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm just going to fly away. <laughs> Oh man, yeah. Hey, what's up, Rusty Signal? It was nice to meet today. Glad that you came out and got to fly and hang out. I uh, look forward to seeing you at another meetup. So, that all that being said, I've shared a little bit of my footage with you guys. It's time to go to your videos. If you haven't been here before, the way that this works, we only open it up for a small window of time. So go ahead and get your links. Go copy the link, uh, and you're gonna go through Discord. There's a link in the description down here. And uh, go over to Discord on the left side of the screen, you'll see a section that says video submissions. That's where you're gonna paste that link and post it up. Now you're probably trying to do that right now and there's gonna be somebody saying, no, that's it won't let me post. And the reason is, is that it's locked down so that nobody can post except for a small window of time. We're gonna open it up here at the beginning and we're gonna open it up when we run out of videos. And then that's gonna be probably more than the two hour time that I've allotted for doing this tonight. So. Uh, where's my mouse? Here we go. Coming over here. Have you got something new for me, monkey? Oh, monkey's already gone. Okay. Send messages. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> I got some. <laughs> nice. All right. So submissions are open right now and go. And they're just flowing in all the videos and we're going to close it. Like I told you, it doesn't last for very long. The, your window of time to submit is so short and closed. All right, how how much damage do we do? Wait, I need I need this thing to be bigger. I can't hardly. A see lot it. of damage. <laughs> that's good. I like a lot of damage. Oh, that's not that bad. Yeah, not bad at all. Okay, cool. So up first we got Red October uh, RC Float Flying. Boom. I'm gonna slide this keyboard over here a little bit closer to myself. Mm -hmm. Dude, post up the link, 507. Ain't no shame. Dude, that's some good looking chase footage right there. Oh my God, he's even got a, a rotating beacon that works on that thing. That is a dope model. I want my own full scale float plane, like very similar to that. I've been eyeing uh, a Kit Fox on floats. I don't know how ideal that is. You know what? I don't even have an orange lighting theme for November. Oh my god, the, the Sony's crapping out on me like over and over. I hope it doesn't keep that up all night. I may just like, no, I can't turn off my cam. Do they have an autumn theme for the lights? I'm digging the jam. Yeah, we got an autumn theme. I 
I'm missing my uh, Halloween theme. All, it had all these like bright uh, greens and purples, and I just I thought that one looked awesome. How much camera angle do you run on these? Hey, Siadi, what's up, man? You got some of that gorgeous sunset footage for us already? We need to see that. Dude, one thing I want to say, you got to, I didn't see this angle in your video, not saying that you don't, uh, didn't get it, but on, when you're following like RC planes, there's this great angle. So like when you're, let's see, I got to, <laughs> hey, look what it is dividing by zero. Uh, <laughs> Um, when you're flying, if you have a lot of angle, you know, this is what looks forward. Um, if you're chasing a plane and you want to get, go backwards and get something from underneath, you're looking up at the plane here, but your quad is actually flying backwards. So you can tuck in underneath the nose and like work with this angle and how far back and forward of it, uh, depending on where your camera is at and everything. And you can fly just like that backwards, uh, underneath the nose of the plane. Just a pro tip next time you're chasing some RC planes and want a cool angle. All right, who we got next? We got Flamingo FPV Daily Night Session. Bring it up. Give me a minute to find out what you're referring to because there's a YouTube lag, but I see what you did. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Wait until you. I had to link my Instagram for what I'm working on. It's in the next phase. Nice, Ciotti. Yeah, Red October. It's it's not a comfortable thing, and you have to trust the uh, RC pilot because he can easily fly you into the ground. Sorry, trying to minimize the number of times that my camera crashes. Didn't mean to block you there. <laughs> JP01, man, you missed the window. That that first window is always a little bit after eight. And then uh, the second one is when we're out of videos. <laughs> Dude, I want to see that seagull footage, Mad Max. <laughs> if, if you were able to track it for any length of time, then I'm impressed. I'm digging this track, though. Oh, my God. The camera froze again. I'm gonna try something. It kind of feels like I'm dying on the inside. It kind of feels like I've been trying to give by the BFI or the BI. Staring at the fire, Kumaya. I'm gonna take you higher, take you higher. I'm gonna take you higher, take you higher. What is going on?
kind of feels like I'm dying on the inside Hmm Okay I am not sure what is happening with the uh, <laughs> news you're about to discover how I sold for some reason, the Sony is just like crapping out every like 10 seconds tonight. Uh, fingers crossed that it lasts a minute now. I've like reset the camera, reset the capture device, I've reset like freaking everything. We got Monkey FPV somewhere in Sarasota from his recent trip to the US. I hadn't seen this footage. How did you not show me your cool Florida footage while you were here? I guess we were too busy out flying, huh? Yeah, we had, we had no time. Yeah. Yeah, I saw Steel's story from like uh, well after sunset there, Ciotti. Felt bad that I had to run, but like I I had to stop at Best Buy. I had to st I stop and get beer. I went over uh, Coda FPV, hooked us up with some uh, yard utensils like a lawnmower for the house and. Uh, some other things that we need and was very grateful to get and not to buy. Dude, that was nice. I love those. The little flick through with the roll. That was, that was very sweet. I hadn't done them in a minute. I kind of go through phases where like I'll do stuff a whole lot. And a I lot, to do yeah. It, and then you just kind of forget and then you remember, oh yeah, that thing was cool. I should do that more. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it happens to me also. Like, mm -hmm. I started doing something, I, I kill it. Like, I mean, not kill it, killing it, but I mean, <laughs> I kill the move all until I. Mm hmm. Chilla killers. Dude. I've been, uh. I have forgotten about this uh, green uh, sauce that I brought back from Mexico when I stayed with Laura. His, yeah. I mean, it's like a really common thing. You can even get it at the grocery stores here. But like, I, it's the guacamole salsa. You know what I'm talking mm -hmm. about? Yep. Oh my god, I put it on everything while I was down there at his house, and then I forgot about it. And then this week, I made some eggs and stuff. And uh, needless to say, I've made eggs and put that on it like three times this week. <laughs> <laughs> it's like my favorite shit. It's so good. Like make a little omelet and put that on it. It's way better than yeah. any hot sauce that the that that uh, breakfast spot by us had. Oh yeah, yeah, but that breakfast spot was good though. It was good, <laughs> but their hot sauce. Uh, they had, yeah. I mean, they had options, but uh, yeah, that's just something different. <laughs> Don't harass the boats. Was that somebody you know? I didn't. I wasn't paying attention. No, no. It was it just wasn't. a rando. <laughs> yeah, rando. They told me like uh, boat, boat, boat. I just took off and followed. Oh god. I follow right. another boat, boat. There were people in there, and they started like with uh, bathing suits, and they started covering <laughs> up. So I just moved away. Oh yeah. We got, uh, oh, Flamingo FPV starting off with the crash reel here. New spot. Time to kill some drone parts. Yeah, it's looking like it, dude. Uh, parking garages are rough. I can confirm. Actually, Ciotti can confirm. I saw him smack some concrete a couple times today. <laughs> This, I mean, all uh, parking garages look a little bit familiar, but this one, I've been at ones that have those circles and everything. <laughs> What's up, Casper? Dude, I need to do some more YouTube thing. I've got a couple videos that need editing, but like Monday through Wednesday this week, I'm going to be like nine to five I get up doing uh, teaching a 107 course. And uh, after that, I got plans on two edits, 
I got all the parts in for the custom builds. If you guys are interested in picking up a Stingy custom build, uh, I have pretty much everything in stock. Just waiting on, I got enough for the first couple, but I'm waiting on motors for the rest of them. Uh, I have three more to sell in the first batch of uh, custom Stingy builds. So hit me up if you're interested in grabbing one of those. And uh, yeah, I got so many things going this next week. It's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be good times. <laughs> yes, you missed the uh, crash rail, Ciotti. I put some uh, shoes, some bumpers on my stinky porch. Oh, yeah? On, yeah, it's, I was seeing that shit too hard. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want them. It's, it's so beautiful. I, I don't want them to delaminate because I'm hitting them so hard. I saw yours. Yours are like... Like, you, Mine are rough. Been, yeah, you, you've been biting into them. I got like a whole box right here. <laughs> of, uh... You eat look, them, though. Look at this. <laughs> you eat carbon, though. Ugh, all the stingy <laughs> forged carbon frames. Nice. That forged. <laughs> Most of them are for uh, sale, but... <laughs> Mad Max says Autotex calls them stinky builds. <laughs> That's funny. There's a friend of mine here in Ecuador that uh, he thought at the beginning that you were, you were, everybody said stinky thing, and he thought you were cold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's a guy on uh, YouTube baby. whose wife calls me stinky, and he always <laughs> leaves a comment about that. Like, she giggles every time he puts my videos on. I mean, whatever. It's nothing but love. <laughs> it is. Can't be mad. No, it, it comes from a good place. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh shit, Wiccan says he went three miles on his Sunday rip and there's a bear in the cliffs, if you see Damn. it. Damn! <laughs> That's some serious long range right there. <laughs> oh yeah. You know you've gone long range when you see a bear. Hey, glad to have you here, El, uh... Oh man, I... Granianyo? <laughs> uh... No. Oh man, are you telling me it's so cold you're already in the car for the winter? I'm not looking forward to those days. Like it was I, I was out in a t shirt today. Like this is all I wore out. Speaking of which, shout out for nice. some uh quad talk podcast love. I'm hoping that uh Code Red swings by tonight. He comes in here every now and then. We got Flamingo FPV. Can we dive the biggest tower in Germany? Right, yeah, that's right. That's next. It's a funky looking tower. Ooh. I hate like nighttime buildings. You can't see shit. Like, look at that. That's just like, whew. <laughs> oh man, of all the things, yeah, that SD card. That's what I was gonna say. Like the smashed GoPro is one thing that kind of sucks, but the, the SD card, oh, sad. Oh. <laughs> Johnny Five's alive. Wait, aren't they rebooting that movie? What was that movie with uh, Johnny Five, the robot? Does anybody in the chat here remember? Short oh, my. Circuit. Short Circuit. I heard they were rebooting Short Circuit. I would love it for a short circuit reboot. Sad thing is, is with today's AI, it's not too far. Yeah. I 
I don't know if this is going to happen or not because they started talking about it in like 2012, and here we are. Does Neil find a way to ruin it like Star Wars? I was. I actually watched some of the gameplay from that new Star Wars game today. It doesn't look as bad as I would have expected. I might have to get a Star Wars game. I've had My better look. Are playing that game. You, wait, you, who's playing it right now? Uh, a couple of friends of mine are playing it right now. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Any good? Single they player. like it? They like it. It's a uh, single player only, right? But it, they like it, yeah. Well, if Star you're Wars, into Star Wars, you're gonna love it. Yeah, that's kind of the thing. It's like, I don't think I love Star Wars enough. Yeah, that's the thing. But it does look cool. If it was part of like some game pass, like Xbox Game Pass or something, like maybe. I don't see me spending like sixty bucks to play it though. Mm -mm -mm. No. If you never played uh, Knights of the Old Republic, which is a DC Star Wars game, if it's like that, it'll be good. Hmm. Yeah, I've still been playing the crap out of some Battle uh, or Call of Duty Battlefield. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Call of Duty, yeah. Battlefield is like a uh, deck. Yeah, Siani, I was actually watching Dr. Disrespect play it when I was eating like lunch today. And uh, that was entertaining because he does not play uh, single player games or action adventure or anything like that. And he was just raging on it. I, don't, I find that dude entertaining. I like Dr. Disrespect. Yeah, he's a funny guy. Mm hmm. He, he, has, he has a good character. For sure. Guillermo! <laughs> Guillermo's here. Always. We need some Guillermo yeah, FPV power. videos. Yeah, where's your submissions, bro? Yeah, I want to critique them. Put it up. <laughs> <laughs> Just joking. That doesn't sound menacing at all. Rival FPV buttery sunset rippage. Like I said, popcorn and props tonight. Now with butter. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for making it true. I'm looking up, as I'm looking up, suddenly the sky erupts, sky erupts, sky erupts. I'm digging the jam. Like the trees, to fall the leaves, if I'm on fire, how am I so deep in love? Yeah, I like this song. I, I, I think I've heard another, another version of this song. Oh. I like this version. Yeah, I missed that Quad Talk podcast too. It was a good one. What what podcast are you talking? About? Uh, the Quad Talk podcast. It was originally Von Quad, and um, um, oh my God, I can picture him. Love the dude. Oh my God. No, I can't think of the guy's name. He's a uh, the Cali guy. Hangs out at X Hover all the time. Uh, that guy. I'm. It, eventually, he yeah, left and Code Red came back and took his place. Uh, but I can't think. It, that's gonna bug me. Brandon. But what's his FPV name? Brandon FPV. No. El Granio, we only watch videos that are submitted through Discord and the Discord window for submission. We open it up at the first, and then we open it up again when I run out of videos. So if you want to submit your video, there's a link in the description for the Discord server, and on the left side of the screen, you'll see something that says uh, video submissions. That's where you post it up, but you won't be able to do that until I announce that we're open for submissions, because we like to get through all the videos every night. Uh, and that's how we manage it. We just open it up for a little bit of time. So that's this how you guy. get it. <laughs> He's just, he, he got Bruno Mars is in the house. 
Oh wait, who's this where, guy? Remember that guy that came with us? Yes. Who's Bruno yeah. Mars on on YouTube? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'd love to play your video. Uh, just if you if you're gonna hang out for the night, you'll get a chance. Uh, I'll give you a good warning when there's like two or three videos left to go but right now let's see how many we got left we got 25 <laughs> yeah we got like a lot i didn't say 25 but it's quite a few yeah. uh Maiko letting off steam All right, you better fly hard. That's all I got to say. If you're going to use some tunes like this. You got to go hard. All right, all right. Between alternating between 15 degrees up tilt and like 50 degrees up tilt, found up in the top of like 40, 50, 50 degrees. <laughs> How? What did you? Uh, what technique did you finally use to get it down? Uh, two 40 foot poles that we put together with about 10 foot overlap. <laughs> nice. At least it worked. Yeah, I tried. I didn't have turtle mode engaged, but I had like the 180 arm, and it had wedged itself right in the fork, kind of like a palm tree. And when I'd arm to give it full throttle, you'd see like leaves because it's fall. You'd see the tree just start exploding. It was like it was farting leaves in the air. <laughs> the kid was sitting there watching me. He's like, probably a fourth grader. He's like, man, it's really up there. I was like, yeah. He just kept it like rubbing salt. Trying to decide what corner I like to be in the best. I feel like I should be in a corner that has me looking more in towards the screen. But if I put it in the top left, then it I feel it it blocks more actual content. Even though it makes me like God looking down on the FPV videos. <laughs> know where to turn off autoplay and I like leaving autoplay on for my account because like when I when I take a break from working and like eat lunch or whatever I'll put on YouTube and I just like let it go autoplay because uh, I usually pick like I don't know some kind of video that autoplay is gonna work well with yeah I do that when I build I'll just put it and let it go like comedy or something like that you know or, or watch hot ones and then just like watch hot ones after hot ones after hot ones. I feel like eventually I'm, I'm going to be running out of hot ones episodes pretty soon. That's such a good YouTube show. I mean, it's a, it's a clever premise, but the dude that does the interviews is just so freaking good. What is the, what is the show called? I've never seen that. Hot ones. It's the uh, show where they eat hot, spicy wings. There's ten wings, okay. and they get hotter and hotter and hotter <laughs> as you go along. Okay. And then he asks you questions. But he just does a really good job <laughs> at interviewing, like really well researched. He'll like pull some random things out of your past, and like it's not your average interview either. Uh, that's great. And people end up wigging the hell out, like crying or. Some people go so hard, like, go watch Paul Rudd's episode. That's a good one. A good recent one. <laughs> nice rip. I was digging that. All right. What do we got next? Up next, Eric B's FPV. Sunset float. Dang. That sounds like an ice cream float. Now my sweet tooth is activated.
<laughs> I've seen quite a few doppelganger uh, comments uh, over the years. Yeah, Gordon Ramsay was another really good episode of Hot Ones. I like that one too. The uh, Gordon Ramsay, Paul Rudd, um, who? Yeah, there's been quite a few good ones that I really liked. I'm not sure if I've seen Kevin Hart's yet. I watched one today that I, I YouTube has been recommending the hell out of to me, and I I'm not like a huge fan of hers, but I watched it anyways, and I was kind of impressed. And that was Kristen Stewart. Um, I actually liked her a lot in that interview. Which one, is her? Uh, Kristen, okay. she was the Let's chick go. from the Twilight movies, like forever okay, ago. Okay, She's okay, done okay. a million yeah. things since then, but yeah. She's, uh, she looks uh, like a really shy person. Yeah, like I've never paid. I've seen her in a couple of movies here or there, and I've never really thought about her personally. But she was more interesting than I expected. Hot Wings. That's the game. The show. Hot ones. Hot one. All right. I'm go I'm not gonna download it from an illegal torrent. Have you watching The Mandalorian at all? The what? The Mandalorian. I don't even know what that is. The, the, that's a uh, Disney Mandalorian. The, the, that's you know Boba Fett, uh, the bounty hunter from. Star I did Wars? see a. I saw a billboard for that. Is that like a new uh, series it's on the Disney series. Plus? Yeah, exactly. That's it. Yeah. On no. the origins of the Bob, Boba Fett and shit. I don't have uh, Disney Plus. You don't need that. You don't? No. There's then a seven day trial. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm kind of over uh, adding all of these streaming services. It's getting ridiculous. And now like everybody's getting into the game. Like HBO's they, breaking they, they, out they there. Know Plex. Huh? Like, the Ple do you know Plex? Yeah, yeah, I have Plex. Plex. Okay, I'm gonna give you access to our Plex server. That's on Fiverr. You're Dude, never I... gonna need any streaming service again. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I used to be. There was a time, like when I first got into FPV, I was that for everybody. Like I had it, my computer set up to automatically download all the TV shows that I used yeah. to watch, and like, I. Yeah, yeah. I but over the Let years, things later. kept breaking, and I just never got around to fixing it. Because I was spending less and less time watching stuff, and uh, now this it's one, it, completely this dead. One, I this one's a, a, co a community one, so mm. there's a, a bunch of us. We paid for the fiber mm -hmm. to the server, and uh, I, we paid it like five bucks. It's not much, but and but there's like three or four people like with radar and everything, like. Making sure all the shows are up and they're yeah, <laughs> just big guys. I feel you. Dang, Eric B trying to step on my toes now <laughs> with that stinger. <laughs> I'm kidding, man. Uh, we got prop breaker, golden sunrise. Wait, wait, wasn't that just golden float that we just watched? Sunset float. Liking the cinematic effects. I had to throw it in chat, but I'm fearful for Black Friday this uh, <laughs> uh oh. Any any particular thing you're waiting Black Friday, I mean uh, You know, I was wanting to get a TV, but I'm not sure that it's gonna happen. You get like super good discount. 
I so. know, but I just don't have the extra cash for it. I don't really need a new TV. Yeah, you don't need it. As much as I want one, I don't need it. I mean, I'm mostly just sitting here at my computer anyways. Yeah. I had a dream the other night that I crushed one of my sessions and was able to go in and warranty repair it so I can upgrade the 360 camera. Mm. Alright. You can do that without dreaming. If you have the adventure. Casper asked, what was the first quad you lost and what was the one that hurt the most? The first one I lost was uh, in Hawaii. I was filming uh, for... Uh, teal drones thing commercial thing and uh i bounced it into the ocean but you know what i don't even i'm not even mad at that because i ended up getting to spend a day snorkeling in hawaii looking for it uh didn't find it but i spent a day snorkeling in hawaii looking for it so uh that one was actually a pretty nice one to lose then uh, the one that hurt the most though was the original stingy uh prototype for the first frame was my first signature frame. It was custom cut and everything. I lost it in the uh, pond at Joe Nall. And that one sucked because I never got it back. And uh, I went waiting for it forever. And I ended up getting uh, beaver fever. <laughs> and uh, my stomach was not good for like about two or three weeks after that. That was miserable. I don't, don't, don't go swimming in stagnant pond water. It's a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, I was worried about some sort of duck shit fever or something like that when I went looking for the drone I lost in the lake for eight hours in the lake. Oh my god. Elgato Camlink, get your shit together. <laughs> get your shit. Like, this is obnoxious. What happened to that shirt? Fix your shit shirt. I thought <laughs> Quicko was coming out with it. So. No, he's got the do epic shit shirt. Yeah, no, he, no, he needs a fix your shit after you do epic shit and fuck your. <laughs> Shit, I'm gonna make the uh, fix your shit shirt because that's a good idea. There you go. Watch for that on my channel next week. Fix your shit. Where is it? Come on, man. Fix your shit. <laughs> mm. What would be the text version of the Jetsons like uh, car sound? That you know the. Because that's what a shitty quad sounds like, and so we can have like a quad <laughs> with a Jetsons uh, sound coming out of it. And yeah. you say, fix your shit. <laughs> fix your shit. Bring your shit back and fix your shit. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that amphitheater is looking pretty, pretty sweet, I gotta admit. Mm. Very nice, very, very nice. Oh, wait! Joel, Stairway to Heaven. We got another video from the Stairway to Heaven. This is not a submission. We're not going to watch the whole thing. You know, it's been a minute since I saw that. That's a beautiful place. I miss Hawaii. Just speaking of Hawaii, uh, on the trip to Hawaii where I lost a drone, Steel went and hiked the Stairway to Heaven and ripped that shit back then. Okay. Okay. God, it's like every 30 seconds I've got to reset the camera. Haas FPV, bring in the avocados. <laughs> I'm going to keep making that joke because it makes me happy. FPV wing chase, wow, they are fast. Yes, FPV wings are stupid fast. a good track what is this I, I recognize this oh um modest mouse that's a horrible place for that camera to freeze <laughs> i want to play call of duty d sky 
<laughs> That's what I was doing before you your stream started. Oh. I was getting my hardcore on. <laughs> El, El Granaino, he, he, he's telling me that he pasted a, a video already, but I, I doubt he pasted it on the right place. <laughs> it's not open right now. I mean, maybe he got it in the right spot. No. <laughs> <laughs> it was closed already when he came. Unless you left it open. I hope I didn't leave it open, because if I left it open, then we're not getting through all the videos tonight. I'll tell you that right now. Did somebody submit a 10-minute video? Well, we'll skip. That's got to be a, a vlog with talkie. We'll skip ahead and play, like, one flight segment and then call it a day. APK. There's so many things out there to like. Uh, I just don't have enough time to watch enough content to really justify all of that. How did Flamingo got to me? I want to see somebody do a perch on a building with a wing. If you can perch nah. a building with a wing, I'll be impressed. <laughs> I'm going to start calling this coronaries and catheters because every time you post one of these, I've been barbecuing or smoking for most of the day. <laughs> struggling to keep up with that wing you gotta tell your wing pilot to slow the hell down <laughs> that battery was done that's why it was done he's full throttle trying to keep up with it <laughs> familiar with any new proposed legislation in the US I do remember hearing that there was some proposals for practical tests meaning that you'd have to do some like flight testing and I mean I don't know uh, I'd have to read through whatever the uh, FAA proposed uh, drone registration legislation is See, I don't think, I don't think... Yeah, I don't see anything proposed El in the Granaino, news. El Granaino posted, he keeps saying that he posted a video, I don't see that. So I think he's not posting in the right way. <laughs> I mean, if it's not showing up on the uh, thing, then it's not the right Dude, place. Dude, I look around the whole Discord. 
<laughs> He's probably just like sending me private messages. Me. <laughs> A lot of people have been posting in all the things. All the things. Yeah, that's not the right place, folks. Oh, yeah, there's people posting in all yeah, the, the place to submit videos is over here under video submissions by Popcorn and Props. And unfortunately, it is closed to submissions right now. Uh, wait, yeah, we just watched the Haas. So up next is J-Bo, FPV, Old Spot, New Flow. We only open it up a couple of times a night. That way we're able to get through all the videos. If I leave it open the whole time, then people will just come by and like spam their videos and not even hang out to watch everybody <laughs> else's. They're just like, watch my video, bye. And so it's really there for people that want to hang out and watch videos with people and chat. So you kind of have to be here at the start of the stream or be here just chilling watching videos to know when the second opening is. That's kind of, it's by design. <laughs> yeah. Old spot, new flow, FPV freestyle. It's a good design. It's been working so. As they say in Joe Dirt, it's not about you. It's about the consumer. <laughs> j -Bo came back to the spot, same spot as last week, but he's hitting that gap, he says. The one that I was like, oh, I want to oh, see it. He felt challenged. Nice. <laughs> yeah, it's all good, Wiccan. We're not worried about the length of your video. We'll, uh, we'll watch it at quadruple speed if needed, uh, but I want to see that epic three-mile rip along with the bear, so it, it's going to get played. Oh, yeah, I bet I see a freaking bear. I know, right? I'm going to be mad if that bear <laughs> consists of like two... That bear. It better be more than two pixels. If it's not more than two pixels, I'm pissed. <laughs> Easy ass spot down there. That's the bear. Mm -hmm. That's a leaf. Yeah, Danger Dave totally will watch it. All you gotta do is uh, post it up on the Discord server under video submissions when we open them up in a minute. You probably just heard my whole rant on that subject. <laughs> Ooh, like that little reverse. That was kind of nice. That takes a lot of balls to remix uh, This Is America. There's that gap. I don't think that I would remix a song that's so politically charged. <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying I don't like it, it's, it's good. I just think I, if I was choosing songs to remix, it wouldn't be the one I'd pick. Oh! <laughs> Fucking that hole up. <laughs> do Wiccan do you don't let people be judgy and tell you what to do do what makes you happy I make 20 minute long videos so anybody that wants to bitch about like length of video whatever I make what I want to make little episodes your 20 minute videos are the only ones I don't speed through <laughs> nobody else gets that honor <laughs> well I appreciate it yeah, I don't know. I, I I would rather not make 20 minute videos most of the time because it's a lot of work, but I, I make the video that I feel like is called for. Scarecrow FPV. This is how we do things in the country. FPV adventures. In what country? Uh, Scarecrow lives over in Asheville. I'm not sure where this is, but uh, he's in the southeast. It's uh, just outside of Asheville. Nice. Okay. Oh, glad to have you in here too. Yeah, he's in here. Um, and there's like a bunch of blabbering afterwards that you told totally me. I'm digging the color grading. Thanks, man. Got a nice look. Oh, thank you, Slash7. Hell yeah for joining on the, uh, Patreon. You know what's crazy is that I thought for sure when I launched the Patreon that I would hit 100 patrons fairly quick. And so I set the goal for the backpack giveaway at 100 patrons. I was going to give away a Torval Pit Stop backpack. 
and uh, I think I'm sitting around like 60 or 70. I just need like maybe 30 more patrons, and then I'm gonna ship. I'm gonna give away a Torville pit stop backpack to one of the patrons, and uh, yeah. So if you are interested in winning a Torval pit stop backpack, then uh, go sign up on my Patreon. I love that backpack. I do too. I'm actually working with them on some like, new stuff. Oh, nice. I so, bought it on the trip to Atlanta. Nice. All right, I will do you the favor of skipping your talkie talkie. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Everybody likes to make the talkie talkie, but then they cringe when they play it. <laughs> well, I don't want you know, it's not the proper venue, I don't think. That's fair. fair. Uh, I, crashed uh, on roof, I crashed on the roof of that thing and had to go up there. Gotcha. Dude, did you see my clip at the beginning of this? The uh, uh Yeah. Oh that was crazy. God. That was crazy. <laughs> I didn't mean to click it in here. Swift Fox FPV with flying with some birds oh that that's why were you that's why you were talking about the tango switches because you have to do all the switching yeah because i was like when turtle heard, mode mm, arm mm. Yeah, flip okay, over okay. disarm turtle <laughs> mode off rearm it worked it worked yeah it, was, it turned out fine i like the button the yeah button. i like them too Oh my goodness, we're gonna just turn that down a little bit more even. Yeah, the prop noise is a lot. <laughs> Flying's all right. Got a nice sunset. Cool little spot. Digging it. Ah, oh, I tell you what I'm not digging is resetting this camera. Over and over and over and over. The Sony. What's that? The Sony. Yeah, it's probably just because I should have restarted the computer before like doing the stream tonight. Uh, for some reason, the Sony on the PC, it does this all the time. It's like it does a bad job at managing the... It has to do with it, like, managing the USB ports, I think. And, uh, like, I have to reinitiate, the, deactivate and reactivate the camera in OBS. Um, sometimes, sometimes it'll go a whole stream without a problem. Other times, it'll be like this, and, like, literally every 30 seconds, I've got to do it. The Mac, it's never a problem. The Mac, it always just works. But the Mac also struggles to play YouTube and stream. So, it's like... Yeah. Oh, Danger Dave. Well, I'm glad I could help. Uh, yeah, drone pros... <laughs> Wow, that was uh, a long, long time ago. Ah, well, thank you, uh, Casper, for coming and checking it out. Yeah, you know, I mean, I've been making videos since before doing Rotor, since before Rotor Riot existed, and uh, I don't plan to go anywhere. I'm gonna keep doing my thing. No, it's not about the driver update or anything. It, it really has nothing to do with the Sony. Like, it, the camera's fine. I'm not resetting the camera at all. It's the, uh, the, um, the I'm not even resetting the, the hardware at all. It, it's, I don't know why it does that. It just will freeze. And it, the audio from me is coming through the camera. Uh, it's actually a mic right here. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for your headphones. <laughs> the um but 
Yeah, the audio keeps working. It's just the image freezes and deactivating and reactivating it seems to fix it. Ah, oh, Guillermo is calling it a night. Lame. I need to go to bed somewhat early tonight too, though. I got to get up and drive across Georgia tomorrow. Yeah. Where are you? Um, oh, elegy. You're going to teach that class, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah, it's up in LJ, which is uh, about an hour 45 from here. Yeah. Speaking of which, let me just double check that it is the time that I think it is. <laughs> Google it. Google Maps. <laughs> Otherwise, and the stream is over. We're going to bed tonight. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Nice. <laughs> Getting that orbit in. Hell yeah, thanks for posting, Swift Fox. What's up, Kevin? A monkey. Hey! Yeah. I know that voice. All right, now we got dividing by zero. Just another Brian on Instagram. Uh -oh. It's oh. just something. What's it's version two of what I started last. <coughs> That's interesting. Mm. Yeah, if I'm gonna go from 15 to 60 degrees up tilt, I should be able to Maddie forever. Oh, but I also want to do it. All right, now we got Wick and FPV. I knew it was gonna do that. I'm going to skip us up to the flight. This is our three mile long range to go see a bear. I'm going to see a goddamn bear. Dude, Wiccan, where is this? This looks like uh, where I grew up in like uh, Northeast Tennessee, like the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains. Where are you at? Oh, thank you, Danger Dave. <laughs> Cheers, my dude. A head tracker on the quad. That would be, uh, that would be a lot. Okay, so we ripped real close to ourselves, like hard. Was there a cut? Did I miss a cut? I don't think there was a cut. Oh, okay, no. That's not the long way away one. My rule of thumb is if you're gonna fly a long range thing, do it at the beginning of the battery. Don't like rip a bunch and then do it because then you misjudge and end up stuck. Don't ask me how I know. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that is what we're doing. We ripped hard, and then we're ripping to the uh, up to the mountain. Fingers crossed for you, dude. I mean, we got the GoPro footage, so it can't be that bad. Never did get confirmation on where he's at. It does look an awful lot like the southeast, though. I don't know. It could be Appalachian Mountains all the way up north, too, though. You said it looks like Tazewell or something like that, Virginia. It's in the chat. Mm. Oh, Tazewell County, Virginia. Yeah. I'm not sure exactly where that is, but southwest Virginia, northeast Tennessee. Like, I was 10 minutes from the Virginia state line where I grew up. Yep, same thing, Danger Boone. I, I was like 30 minute drive to uh, to Boone. 
I was right there in the corner of Tennessee, just across the line from Virginia and North Carolina. Yeah, there. <laughs> the chat is a little bit behind on my uh, current state. We've been. Uh, I recognize it now. Everybody's like Virginia. He said Virginia. Oh my God. <laughs> The super chat's going Virginia. Virginia. <laughs> yeah, super chat Virginia, do it. <laughs> all right, I'm here to see that bar. <laughs> He's been teasing the bar all night. Where's the? Bar? I don't know yet. I think this is one of those show, like the shows. Uh, those ghost shows, they're gonna show you the ghost at the end of it. Oh, it's, it's like every reality TV show ever. There's like yeah. five <laughs> seconds of good thing, and that good thing is in every single trailer, and then you watch an hour long show to see five seconds of good thing. <laughs> I want to stand on that rock and rip. That you could really long range from. All right, I'm gonna watch the screen over here, just in case that bar is in the corner. I don't miss it. In the corner, I'm covering up. Y'all miss it. Y'all are screwed. But I'm gonna see that bar. So much scraggle. <laughs> Fear this scraggle. I still have that shirt. Dude, I still do too. That is a lot of scraggle. <laughs> That's like flying over water. That's pretty. It makes me yeah. want to go do some long range of the mountains. Have we missed the bear yet? <laughs> oh, he says the bear is hard to see. The bear is two pixels. <laughs> Damn it. He has the base of my click. I got. Owned again. I know. Troll. The bear with that? I know, it's like a leaf, but he's like, but it's a black leaf. <laughs> it's uh, the skunk you can gate. clearly see it's a grizzly. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Mad Max says, Are we bear yet? <laughs> <laughs> What up, Super Deluxe? Mm. Oh, Super Deluxe! Yes, yes, I got that. I got that uh, photo on Instagram. Glad that you're ripping it and it's working out well for you. <laughs> Super Deluxe got one of the custom builds and is loving it. Yeah, nice. tuning video is coming this week. I apologize. I shot it and I was going to edit it, but like I ran into some issues where I had overtuned the quad and I found that if, once you started beating it up, uh, it started doing some bad things. And so I wanted to make sure that the new tune, I'm going to have to like 
show the tuning video and be like, this is a great tune for a fresh, clean build, but as soon as it's not, it's gonna be a problem. And then this is what I detune to. So uh, expect a tuning video with disclaimers, unfortunately. Yeah. Say lovey, what are you gonna do? All right, uh, that was Wiccan FPV. Oh shit, that was the last one. You know what that means. That means that it is time to open up the chat for a new set of videos. Uh, this is good. I'm not gonna give you guys a ton of warning because uh, I don't wanna be streaming till 11 p.m. tonight. And also we aren't going to be uh, leaving it open for all that long because I don't want to be streaming till 11 p.m. tonight. So make sure that you have your, uh, yeah, make sure you got your links ready to go. And we are going live right three. Two, four, one, go. <laughs> All right, and I'm shutting it down in three, two, one, done. Nope, save it. Yeah, done. Yeah, I got it in there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, how many did we get? We got we got a few. We got a few. Wait, all right. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Wait, that shouldn't be nah. still showing up more. Oh, uh, you, you didn't close it. I didn't properly close it. <laughs> what the hell? I failed at closing it. Oh my god. It's all right. It's closed Jeez. now. Is it closed now? Uh, now I'm like I'm no. paranoid. Closed. It's closed. Closed. Okay, God. <laughs> yeah, wow, wow, wow. I said, open for you. Oh, man. Like, <laughs> he was able to chat and everything. I know, yeah. All right, whatever. It is what it is. Let's go uh, check it out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, Wiccan was there. Monkey. Monkey FPV. What do we got with this one? This is Water Silo FPV Freestyle. That was today. That was today in the afternoon. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's why my, my friend said they were watching. Like, wow. <laughs> nice music, monkey. That's good. That's what you want your friends to say when you fly. <laughs> There's a, all those trees around are mangoes, man. We picked up so much mango. Do what kind of mangoes though? Are they yellow mangoes or regular mangoes? What do you mean yellow mangoes or regular mangoes? There's different kinds of mangoes, dude. I know there's a bunch of mangoes, but what do you mean red? I mean I don't know. They they become they start green and they turn orange and red. Okay, yeah, that's like the I like the yellow mangoes. Those are my favorite. Yeah, those are the ones I have at my house. Ooh big yellow mangoes that you can cut up in pieces in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't even know there were like different kinds. I, yeah. Until yeah, there's some fun. Like a couple years ago. Hey, what up, Crownley? That tap. <laughs> yeah. I did a tap before that one that was a little bit too hard. <laughs> <laughs> that silo, man, the top of that silo is super weird. Yeah, like the angle, I can imagine it's not easy yeah. to tap. No. Nice one. All right. Let's nice see. and short. Two minutes. That's a good, good, good time. All right, we got. Uh, I pop one. Who is this? It's not giving me a lot of. Tiny Hawk Freestyle Flight from Nighthawk FPV. That's me. 
Oh, sweet. Yay! <laughs> Everyone loves butters. That's me. Yeah, I don't have the HDO2s. They didn't send those to me. They look promising, but uh, I'm just going to have to... I don't know. I need to... I need to borrow steels and fly some. C Cement Kid, no, I don't race at all. I did a couple of times. Like, I did a little bit back in 2016, but it's just not, like... I don't know. It's not something I really enjoy. I'm not a super competitive person. Uh, like, I did well. I got into nationals and stuff, and but it's just not me. It's a lot of work for, especially if it's not something you love and are passionate about. Yeah. I don't know how, but I fell through that entire tree. <laughs> nice. Setting Google Maps to remind me to leave on time so that I'm not late tomorrow. Important things. <laughs> Thanks for watching, Stingy. <laughs> I'm the worst. What? I don't know. No, I was kidding. Like, actually, thanks. <laughs> it's pretty cool <laughs> that you do this. Oh, I thought he was. As soon as I save up enough money, I'm going to buy your frame and build a five inch hell yeah dude get on that tiny whoops are fun but uh well i mean that's a tiny hawk those things are actually pretty pretty hard uh for what it is i dig them all right it's a star anyways thanks anyways <laughs> all right up next we got crown legion bando park and astro x I feel like I'm. Is there music? Yes, there's music. <laughs> See, uh, now he, he's saying he linked the video on video sub. I told you he wasn't posting on the right thing. So, wait, he didn't post it in the right area still? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. With all that, oh, this guy, they, uh, he has a video I saw from Iceland. That's a good video. Cement kid. I feel like everybody's gonna be doing that, giving up on the orcas and getting on the HDO2s. Like, God. I mean, that's just bad timing for them. I can't. It, it happens. It sucks. But, uh,. Yeah, HDO2s are really nice, and uh, if you're gonna like launch a product, you kinda gotta launch the product. Yep. I speak from experience. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the forged carbon V2. Uh, oh, God. Yeah. We, it got me two stingies, V2. It could have, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, man. Feels bad. Got it. But it's, it's hard when you want to like do something totally different. Like when Armatan came out yeah. with the yeah, it's, it sucks. Yeah. Like, and we that was the thing. Like, we kind of pushed it. I pushed the schedule because I didn't want the reason that we announced it uh, kind of prematurely was that I didn't want to announce a carbon fiber frame and then like two months later be like, oh, and the forged carbon, and then have people be pissed that they bought. Yeah, a different one, and so uh, 
and then it turns out that we weren't ready. You know. Nah. Yeah. You live and learn. The new, but it's it's dope now. <laughs> yeah, it's super dope now. And I beat the hell out of that one. <laughs> I told you I order another frame, right? Oh uh, no, you didn't. I didn't hear that. Yeah, I order another one because I need it. I need it to have some on. <laughs> I might yeah. as well have the whole thing for spares. That's I know. I That's what you did for Schizo's quad, right? Yeah, exactly. Right. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Negler, man, it takes a long time for an arc to get. Oh man. You gotta get Bruno Mars to go pick it up for you. <laughs> yeah. Bruno Mars just posted his uh, his video also here. He posted <laughs> on the right way. Oh man, after I can't help you with that. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> After Steel called him Bruno Mars in the live stream, he... Uh, everybody's calling him Bruno Mars. <laughs> what about San Diego? <laughs> San Diego, I got fucked you. Let's go San Diego. Oh, Steel's just making everybody's life miserable. That'll be his new thing. He's just going to run it and make, give you a nickname when you're stuck. Yeah. Yeah. Especially if it like they they hit it on the nail with the Bruno Mars. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah, they did. <laughs> <laughs> He's saying no. <laughs> I heard. Uh. God, that's funny. This guy plays uh, Call of Duty. Also, really good. Nice. Just... All right. Uh, we got Rival FPV Hospital Bando. Uh oh, epilepsy warning. <laughs> Damn. And I'm froze. Hmm. Hello there. Hmm? Somebody give me. I was being dead. Turn it up! Dang! What do I think about the Hero 8 for FPV? Is it much better than the Hero 7? It is better. I wouldn't say it's much better. The uh, I think one of the biggest uh, improvements to me is the 100 megabits per second uh, encode rate. You're definitely getting more data. It's got more bit depth. I don't know that it's like, yeah. I don't, I, do I notice it? Yes. Is it game changer? I really need to rework a whole new color grading scheme for it to really say if it's game changer or not. Uh, and I haven't done that. The uh, stabilization is much better. Uh, the, the boost stabilization is great. I agree. I the boost is nutty. Nutty, yeah. Yeah. It is really <laughs> I do the same thing with my batteries. I, uh, I I don't really sit on them, but I will like pocket them. I went to a filming thing last year in Minnesota, and I took hand warmers to throw in my lipo bag to keep the bat the batteries nice and toasty when I it was like crazy cold. I ended up not really needing it, but it was a it was a good idea. What up, when FPV? Good to see you. you go to Flight Fest this year. Yeah, the Hero 8s, I don't know about whether, I have not come to a conclusion as to whether it is more durable or less than the 7. You kind of got to smash a lot of them before you can really say one way or not the other. 
Oh, thanks for that, Cement Kid. You're the best. Ugh, fist bump. <laughs> uh, do, do, uh, do you know if Steel's gonna make a face hugger for that thing? I don't know. That would be something you'd have to ask him. He yeah, did. I, 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 me. What did he say, Monkey? He <laughs> says he says he's gonna work on it, but he was gonna work on it. So I don't, I don't think he's gonna be super. Yeah. But that camera needs it more than the other one because it's super fragile and without the removal lens, it's just like you break the lens. Exactly why I was asking. Thanks. But like everybody bitches about the removable lens. My problem with the removable lens is that the removable that lens, that <laughs> lens protector, that like I just smashed the glass out of the removable lens and I never replaced it. But that would be enough to protect the circular lens inside. But once the little square piece came off and I lost it, then the days of the circular lens before it got a scratch and I had to replace the whole camera were numbered. Whereas this, because the square thing doesn't come off, the little circular lens on the inside is always going to be well protected. So I, I actually prefer the non-replaceable uh, lens. Controversial opinion, I know, but... Uh... I would rather have the non-replaceable lens that I won't ever lose. Yeah, yeah it says a guy that has a Best Buy like five minutes from his house. But, well, but I mean, a lot of people do. Not everybody can replace. <laughs> but a yeah. lot of people do. Drive. All right, Dilly the Bish. <laughs> I like that name. <laughs> Dilly the Bish, psycho for battle. I'm digging the flow. Oh, you gotta fuck with that, that smokestack thing. Oh yeah, see? Thank you for pay, like giving me the payoff. I was gonna be disappointed if I didn't see you go underneath that pipe. Woo. I'm digging this edit too. Making me go woo right with the horse whinnying. The only thing I want is better lighting. Oh! But I mean, that's not really your fault. <laughs> Hell yeah, he's getting it, 661. Dang. All right, I keep clicking the wrong screen. Dilly the Bish, getting a sub. Bert was got, only got 58 so far. Hit him with them subs because he's ripping it up, and I want to see more of that. All right, we got Outer Limit of all things tube, Bando. I think I said too many things. Eh. <laughs> Hold me close to life. Dang, now this is a Bando complex right here. I want a spot like this one. Ooh, yeah, beautiful. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, that's a Bando. Oh yeah, it's definitely a Bando. 
<laughs> uh, Submit Kid, no. I've never considered doing any kind of rating or contest that I gotta judge. Because, uh, I don't know. I, I don't want the... Uh, responsibility or having to watch like I don't know I'm lazy <laughs> yeah maybe uh, maybe do something with the stream like pick a that's actually not a bad idea that's not a bad idea yeah like so pick somebody from the stream the to give away yeah. I, I could consider that yeah it's not a bad idea. Yeah. I might try to partner up with somebody to get some cool gear in here for you guys, like get FPV or something, see if they want to give something away on a weekly basis. What is up, Vanover? Dude, you missed Billy Dilly the Bish. Dilly the Bish. <laughs> Dilly the Bish was just shredding it. <laughs> thank you, uh, Vanover, and thank you, Nathan Lupian. Hell yeah, I'll cheers to that. Uh. Oh, okay, so I, is this, uh, I like this. Are you sub to this channel? Just to, you know, just saying. Just a little a little something there for you. <laughs> All right. What do we got up next? We have got Rusty Signal FPV Graveyard. <laughs> Mookie what is up Mookie when you coming back down I need to get up and like fly something in Chattanooga with you Mookie mm -hmm. <laughs> alright all the cemetery haters are properly triggered now Speaking of mangoes, uh, monkey, look what I just found in my in my sampler pack. I got that mango card. <laughs> You're oh, there, there it is. You're yeah. The video is always a little bit behind. Is the Stingy more durable than the Supernova? I think that's a good question for Monkey. I don't... I'm not... Wait, do you have the Supernova? Or you've got something newer, right? Yeah. What do you mean? Schizo Supernova? Did you have that one? Yeah, I had that one. It's, it's ten times more durable than the Supernova. 
And there the you new have skid it. To, yeah, the new skid to it's a QAVR2, like with a little bit, uh, like, stretched arms. <laughs> on it. The new one. But yeah, between the supernova. Nice. No Dude, this one is freaking delicious. Oh my god. So the pineapple Wait, wheat was a beer? Yeah, the pineapple wheat was pretty good. It's a wheat Some beer. Super weird beers. <laughs> but it's like they're all about putting fruit in the uh, in the beers these days. And the uh, <laughs> the uh, the pineapple one was like, eh, it was all right. But this one, like, oh my god, it's delicious. Yeah. This might I would be my think favorite. so. Yeah, mango is a good good thing to mix with beer, I mm. guess. <laughs> I don't know about pineapple. <laughs> <laughs> For real. You keep trying them though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dude, th these like cemetery videos, what always worries me is that like that's just a lot of little stubby concrete things. <laughs> I'm just feel like I'm gonna nail one going like mock fuck low to the oh, ground. Yeah. <laughs> And then I will explode. feel terrible. I hit somebody. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Dude, the Stingy B1 was pretty solid. LJ FPV, but the uh, the weak point on the B1 was that uh, whole the camera like plate. the hole for the camera plate, and uh, yeah, the front. I broke a lot right there. And the V2 has been. Without the hole, it's way sturdier. Uh, I still broke a few right there where the arms meet the main plate, but uh, on the forge car, but I've only managed to do that once, and that was when I was rocking uh, two GoPros. Not saying it's indestructible, but it's uh, it's pretty dang ridiculous. That's yeah, all. it is. D <laughs> Haas FPV back up in here. You got some good stuff. I'm ready. Let's go. Low and slow FPV freestyle uncut. Uncut. Oh, Siani, I think uh, is also. Are you talking about the difference between the V1 and the V2 being four mil to five mil arms? That is also a uh, a distinct difference. Or maybe you were referencing something else that I am unaware of and totally missed. Loving the chill vibe. God, I so am not like looking forward to the rest of winter. Like all these videos with the just scrag. Now that is scraggle, scraggle to find. <laughs> Look at those trees. They're like going <laughs> fucking every direction. Those are ridiculous. Yes, that's <laughs> scraggle nation. That's <laughs> the CMW Banggood. I don't know what that is. Uh, so I haven't ripped it around and so many is mad at Armitan. I, I don't, you know, I, I don't know the whole deal with the whole, I, I know about some of the early drama with Bardwell and Armitan, but you know what? It's not my whatever. Yeah. Bunch of dudes trying to do the right thing and struggling at it. <laughs> That's my take. <laughs> Man, someone stayed up. Mm -hmm. Oh, Catalyst Machine uh, Works new frame. No, I haven't seen it. Uh, you know, honestly, I'm I'm like biased because I make my own stuff and I'm a little bit lazy, so I don't make a ton of other frames. I, I like I definitely look at frames and uh, listen to feedback from other people about all the all the frames that are on the market, but there's just way too many frames for me to keep up and fly everything. So I haven't actually seen it. But I really like uh, Catalyst Machine Works. Good dudes over there that make good products. Uh, lots yeah. of, I had a lot of fun when we did the, uh, when we did our event down there with them. Oh, it's bang God. <laughs> I like that. Screw them. 
still their IP. <laughs> Says interesting frame. All right, now I'm like. The, the best comment I saw on that was that someone was challenging Bing did to clone it, and they put a call to the raging cloner. <laughs> That's funny. It would be funnier if they were actually like, uh, is it a five inch frame? I guess. Oh, uh, it's kind of like the. Uh, I see it. Yeah, that's it's just got a lot going on. I'm I'm more of a simplistic design guy myself. Holy cr like all I'm not talking trash, Kyle. I love the guys over there. They do some really cool stuff. I'm sure that it goes together really interesting ways, but I am more of a simpleton when it comes to frame design. Uh you know, kiss, keep it simple, stupid. <laughs> yeah. All right, anyways. Uh, what else we got? Who's up next? Who'd that be? We got Waba Waba. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, and then like the after time videos. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Wabba Wabba Morning Cruise Time Machine. Now Wabba Wabba. Okay, yes, I have. We've seen Wabba Wabba on here before. Yeah, for sure. There's my cursor. Wabba Wabba. Wabba Wabba. That's why I knew I recognized the whole Wabba Wabba thing, but I was like drawing a blank on why. It's the his kid going Wabba Wabba. <laughs> Oh, Tack was live tonight. Nice. What was Tack doing tonight? Welcome then, Kush. Welcome all those coming from Tack's stream. Hope that you had a good time over there hanging out with my bro. <laughs> <laughs> Super Deluxe says he microwaves his tiny whoop for extra power. Can you do that? Only the lipos. That's all you have to microwave. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't microwave your lipos. Don't oh microwave your lipos. I, it sucks that I have to make that as a, a, a disclaimer yeah. because somebody out there will do it. And the, the BTX on the oven worked. So it did work, but it only worked for like a week gonna... or two. <laughs> yeah, but it'll microwave in the light post probably work for a week. <laughs> I'd, I'd <laughs> say that that probably results in a fire, if I were to guess. <laughs> Most likely. Yeah. <laughs> Drone dro Droid says, Tack doing giveaways, hint, hint. I got the hint. I like the idea of doing like <laughs> once a week giveaway to the best video. Uh, so I think that I, I'm I'm just going to say it right now. We're going to, uh, that is a goal we're working towards now. So uh, not guaranteeing that I'll have something for a giveaway next week, but uh, it will be in the very near future where we're giving away nightly to the top video uh, something. That's a... <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's frozen. OBS locked up. The upload locked up. All right, it's back online. I don't know why it does I that occasionally. <laughs> Uh, can you guys hear me back He's in back. Discord yet? No. You should be able to. I think that that is an internet thing, and I'm not sure why it does it, but occasionally midstream it'll do that to me. I think he's back on YouTube, but we can't hear him. I am on... back on YouTube. Let me just try backing out on Discord. Discord and back in. 
It says that my mic's lighting up. No, how do I just, I don't want to. Oh my God. There we go. And I'm back in. No, Can yeah. you guys hear me in Discord again? Yep. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why it does that, but sometimes the uh, the internet like locks up midstream and goes to shit. But we got it fixed now. And up next, we got D Sky FPV Iceland, aka Bruno Mars. Oh, this is Bruno. Yeah, that's Bruno. Bruno Mars FPV. Like, how come <laughs> you've not changed your uh, uh, YouTube channel name yet? <laughs> Like, I want to see on, copyright on strikes on every video. <laughs> <laughs> All Bruno Mars music. Uh huh. Hey, Double A, good to see you here. Wabba wabba! Apparently, my computer just hates you. I'm Look sorry, that. man. That <laughs> shot, man. Dude, that is a ridiculous shot. I want to go to Iceland. Damn. You should. It's amazing. I want to come back in summer. Woohoo! That seagull is like, I'm going to take your drone out. <laughs> At that point, it's just a gamble. I've heard Look that, that. Uh, Iceland Ooh. is cracking down on drone laws. Though. I haven't looked into it, but I, I heard somewhere that. But oh, where do you... Where do they get him? Like because if you go up to a place like this, so far away from everything, yeah, I, I don't know, man. Maybe they start catching people at customs. Yeah, or something. the airport. Yeah, yeah. Eric B. FPV back in it with another stinger. See what I did there? He's got a, he's got a stinger logo. <laughs> Hey, Panda, I mean, if you want to get me a ticket, I'm down. Let's go. Woo oh, no. <laughs> it's not over yet. That's just the teaser. Yeah, it was an epic location. Left me wanting more, too, though. a nice sunset digging the cup the uh changing colors yeah trees are popping Like the last half of that video, I thought there was a problem with my uh, stream. I'm like, why is it not filling up the thing? It's <laughs> it was the video. His video wasn't filling up the screen. My bad. All right, up next we got slash seven waves in the wind. I'm not something beach Cos Island FPV. Every one of your desires. Nice cement oh, kid. I hope you like that remix V2. I saw Tommy ripping that when he was in town. 
Most yeah, it looks a lot stronger than the uh, V1. Before you know it. That remix, it's a very great frame. Yeah, uh, center of gravity <laughs> is great, and uh, you feel that. Okay. I hope I'm not getting sick. I've been sneezing a lot today. It's a, everybody that's saying it's frozen uh, refresh. It's before you know it. You're walking. <laughs> You're running. Speaking of creepy, the voice in this video is like creeping me out a little bit on the You're song. Flowing. <laughs> oh no, that surf <laughs> coming in hot. With the wind. Dang. All right, what do we got? Oh, we're into the overtime videos. <laughs> I don't even get the uh, info ahead of time on these. So we're just going to click it and roll. Big oily guy, you if you dive it they will watch. Alright, I mean I guess I guess we're here for the watch. For the what? To watch. Yeah, I don't know. Ah, uh, you cut out for a little bit. Oh really? Yeah. For like a solid fifty seconds. Mm -hmm. My computer's begging for mercy. It's saying it's, it's time to end the stream. <laughs> Your overtime videos are killing me. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> but I will point out that if I had have properly stopped the submissions, I would have been out of videos now, and it's like now 10 yeah. o'clock. It was like right on point, but I yeah. just uh, didn't click all the boxes like a normal person. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. That, was a nice, that was a nice smash right there. Oh, El Grano FPV is next. So we're definitely, this is going to be the last video of the night, guys. I hope you enjoyed the stream. <laughs> we'll be back here next week and not watch any of the rest of the videos. <laughs> uh, yeah, this looks like a multi-pathing nightmare. Man, you guys don't know how good you have it with rapid fires and fusions yes. and all this shit now. Like when we first started out with like the basic like next wave receiver, oh my god, this yeah, shit this now is so 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 much better. And people wonder why how we fly through as much breakup as we do, and the reason is because we started out on next wave, and so you just had to be able to fly through breakup like that. Yeah, you're just 
Hell, I didn't even have next wave. I had the Attitude V2s that had their own built-in shitty receiver. I don't, I don't like to ha blow up people's spots either. Put them on blast. <laughs> Drone Droid says, haha, the next wave is what he upgraded to. Western Pennsylvania. I'm getting over there near cold country. Still mills. Whoo! The fusion is dope. And the damn camera froze again. All right, note to self. Do not start a stream on the PC unless the uh, you have done a reboot of the PC in the preceding 30 minutes. <laughs> Ugh, this is getting obnoxious. But we're nearly at the end. Just got a couple more. This is our Grano. No, wait, we got another one from Big Oily Guy. No, I just clicked the thing. Bueno, chavales, pues, hola a todos. Cuánto tiempo ya he hecho un vídeo. La verdad que está muy liado. Está muy liado con muchas cosas. Además, como estáis viendo, sin granada para pasar las navidades. Que bueno. We're skipping to the flying, bro. Felices navidades. Oh wait, I'll let you, I'll let you climb on stuff though. I'm, a, I'm gonna allow this. <laughs> oh, he's a beast. It's a jungle gym. <laughs> no, but for real, I'm a little jealous. I wish I could do all that. I feel like I'd rip my shoulder apart. <laughs> Oh man, this is my kind of spot. I like this little playground of dives, etc. Now my question is, did you get between the bars on the little, my camera shut off, you can't see the motion I'm doing. Uh, did you, the monkey bars, do we dive between the monkey bars? That's all I want to know. Because all the other gaps are pretty easy and just, like, good for messing around. I want to see the dive through the monkey bar. Backwards. And then if you do that, then I want to see the dive through the little hole in the wavy bar. Because that's even smaller. Uh-huh. All right. <laughs> that is some killer flying, too. <laughs> <laughs> Drone Droid says, oh shit, it's calisthenics time. <laughs> Back. Uh, why is it doing this to me? All right. I, caught, I saw it happen early, so I paused the video. So you guys aren't really actually missing anything. but I still don't have a clue why it keeps doing that. Because the only thing that happens, uh, I don't get any drop frames. It's just the upload, upload rate in OBS goes to zero kilobytes per second. Uh, CPU usage is fine when it happens. Everything looks fine. I, that's what makes me think that it's uh, an internet thing. I don't know. It's weird. Oh shit. Hitting this reminds me of that Muscle Beach video. Although it's not as small as that. <laughs> Going for the perch. Oh, 
Oh, so close. <laughs> Dang, nice rip. Nice rip, for sure. All right. Uh, this one, and then one more. It's Gumby flying an FPV drone above the clouds in the South Carolina mountains. There ain't no mountains. In, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> I guess you do get some mountains in South Carolina. Just barely. Them chill, chill links. That Casey Neistat jam. is definitely a nice effect kind of makes me wish you'd like go down there and like cruise it <laughs> now i want to do that damn it Funny, anytime somebody asks to get a follow like uh, El Granio, I, I'm saying your name wrong. I know it, and I'm sorry. Uh, it's like he's like, follow me on Instagram, blocked, hidden. Or people are like, watch my video. <laughs> YouTube automatically blocks it. Yeah. Yeah. I unblock it. I mean, yeah, it's people like asking people to go away from the stream, but you know. Everybody got to eat. <laughs> <laughs> what up, MBFPV? How you doing tonight? You made it just in time for the end of the stream. Literally have one video left to go. And then it is all over. Another one from Panda FPV. <laughs> we got Cascade Surfing. My man's got 19 subs. Just starting out, just getting his 107. Oh shit. Are we going all the way to the top, my dude? Are we going to that peak? Are we ascending the mountain before us? Oof. These make me nervous. <laughs> he says as far as his battery let him hey as long as you don't get on the back side of that mountain and lose video and lose the quad we're good here yeah, you know, Drone Droid says uh, he always thought follows should happen organically based on merit, not mentions. I, That's true. I agree, but uh, man, I know a lot of really talented pilots that can't seem to get... I, I know a lot of pilots that are more talented than me that can't seem to get the same traction that I've gotten. I don't have a magic bullet solution. There's not one. It's just... Uh, some mix of personality and skill and I don't know. Super windy out there. Looks oh, yeah. like it. <laughs> that is a Tyler Durden comment. Yeah, man. I, I enjoy the fact that I get to uh, shine some light on some... Uh, some videos that people may not have seen and it's i like it because it's cool because we just get to hang out and give props and pointers and like 
talk about cool stuff and FPV and enjoy this awesome hobby we all share. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to go get me another one of these mango beers after the uh, just a heads up guys after the stream is over I'm gonna go hop on Call of Duty for a minute uh, and get you know I gotta get my nightly headshots in and uh, <laughs> I kid you know what's crazy is I was so burnt out on Call of Duty years ago. I have not played them in years, and it's really refreshing coming back in after yeah. a while. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. All right, we got questions real quick that we're going to answer in the uh, chat. Wiccan asks, Stingy, how does the prize the week before to make us fly harder for the win? Someone in the stream said they had plenty of giveaway stuff for you. Uh, I, you know, that's not a bad idea, but I, I would like to announce what the prize is going to be ahead of time to give some incentive. Uh, but, like, I had never even thought of tying a prize into the stream. So it's just, it's new to me in my head. I got to figure out the mechanics of how I want to manage all of that. And then, uh, like, is it something we're going to vote on? Is it something where I pick the winner? Like, I don't know which is... I got to think about these things and uh, figure out how I'm going to source stuff. I don't want to just take whatever from anybody, like, for giveaways. I want to... If we're going to do a giveaway, we're going to do it right, and it's going to be cool shit. That's all I got to say. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, stay tuned. There will be announcements in the future about said giveaways, but I'm not going to just, like, jump the shark and, like... Well, yeah, I'm not going to go crazy uh, right off the bat. We'll get there. So what else? We got to... Uh... Yep. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this. Give me a like, a follow, a hangout. We're back here every Sunday. Uh, Thursday nights, I do a 107 stream. And uh, although those are... Uh, I do one a month public. Last week, I did my one for the month that was public. And uh, they're going to be just for the people that are signed up for the 107 course through Patreon. Link in the description if you want to get your 107. Uh, I have a whole backlog of live streams where I go over all the material. We do practice questions together. And every week I do another live stream. And also, uh, this week, if you have your 107, just a heads up. This week, I'm going to be walking everybody through how to get your nighttime waiver. So if you've got a 107 and you'd like to be able to legally fly at night, I will be showing everybody that is part of the 107 course how to get your nighttime waiver. It's not that hard. You can follow along on like an hour and a half long stream and get your night waiver and be able to rip at night like me. So uh, yeah, if you want to do that, sign up, link in the description, and uh, we'll catch you guys next time. Be back here next Sunday, though, for sure, for another Popcorn and Props, and uh, we'll see y'all soon. All right, later. Wait, stop it over here. <laughs>